hi all welcome back in this video we are just uh, going to explore uh, more options of x recorder okay how can you how can we use it in class so i'm just going to x recorder so when you click on this x recorder just click on okay so when you click on this x recorder you can see that automatically these three icons appear on your screen on your mobile screen like you can see a camera thing here then you can see a brush thing here and you can see a uh, photo thing here okay so these are the three things here on your screen and this is very easy okay so you don't have to always open this x recorder thing and you can find this thing here also see you can see record option screen option tools home exit everything here also okay and next is like you know when you want to to start a, a class and uh, uh, you what you can do is like you know you can just go to your uh, page yeah i'm just going to take this uh, one ppt so either you can select it from here see you can see the record button here otherwise just click on this button okay so here appears four icons okay so this is the recording thing and uh, again settings so you can go to settings just click on settings and if you want you can turn on the camera okay so yes and see you can see my face here so i just i'm just going to keep it here so wherever you want you can place it and if you want like you know yes i'll just keep it here so i'm just going to uh, teach the lesson so my topic is what is online journalism and you can just give start recording okay so it just uh, record okay um, because just because i'm using another uh, another screen recording tool to record this thing uh, it is not supporting two recording tools okay so as i told you uh, uh, two recordings like you you cannot use two recorders together so uh, i am just using now i am just uh, i just switched to x recorder so you can see that uh, this icon here so you can see that it is getting recorded here uh, if you want to uh, pause this recording you can pause it here see the pause button then if you want to take a break or something or if you want to do something in between you know important thing uh, so you can pause it but in other uh, screen recording tools it is not possible this pausing is not possible so, um, i always feel it's it's very comfortable when you have a pausing system there uh, it is really good uh, because otherwise you have to you know go back and edit all your data you know in between you want like you know and unnecessary things and all you need to uh, delete it that is uh you know pretty difficult then you can stop button so this is the stop button once you stop it uh, the thing will get i mean the recorded video will get saved in your uh, gallery okay then the next button you can see this uh, button here you can see the screenshot and uh, the camera brush microphone everything is there the orientation if you want you can change now it is a uh, landscape orientation if you check the first video you can see that it just comes in a mobile format so i purposely did it because uh, i want you to understand this is just for your mobiles because nowadays it is easy so uh, next is camera if you want to switch on the camera you can switch on the camera okay so these are all options then i told you next is uh, uh, you can make the class interactive by using this palette here you can see this palette if you click on this palette you can see different colors so i'll use the green color uh, so you can write here you can interact with students you can mark you can you know uh, draw a line or draw a circle so you can make this thing interacting like whenever you uh, utter something whenever you say something you can underline those points and you can explain it to the students so that is another uh, important possibility of uh, this particular uh, tool when you close it it just disappears okay it captures your screen it's not just captures your uh, the the presentation alone so if suppose if you want to teach a page uh, suppose uh, you want to demonstrate something else or if you want to show them something else you can just go you can just show them so now you can see my dictionary so it is possible through this particular app once you stop the video you can you get a window like this that it shows like your uh, 
video saved in a particular folder or you can see it in your gallery also so if you want if you if you feel it's not good you can delete it there if you want like edit it you can edit it if you want to forward it you can forward it so that is also possible here uh, to record this particular thing i use another tool that is screen recorder okay so this is the screen recorder so it also has uh, the same uh, i mean almost same application and uh, this thing came before x recorder so when x recorder came actually uh, people stopped using screen recorder because x recorder has uh, you know more options than screen recorder okay so both work in the same manner okay so you can use uh, uh, you know both these things and as i told you x recorder has most fa more facilities and it is easy very user friendly so you can try that you know if you have just a mobile phone you can uh, you know teach your students with that mobile phone you don't need a you know desktop or a you know a camera uh, a camera or uh, you know other uh, web tools to actually screen your i mean record your screen so you can use your mobile phone so make use of these uh, very small app and try it it is it is different and it is really good thank you